Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Tanks Gaming today with another Hearts of Iron 4 video. Last we left off uh, with communist, no, with fascist Russia. Last time we left off, we did finish off uh, all the Finnish war up here. Uh, we did join the Axis in one of the last episodes. We did get a claim on uh, Turkey. And we are preparing our assault, meaning I have my Marines ready to go. I did advance the time a little bit, so I just can hit the start button on the Marines at any time I want. Same goes for uh, my armies over here. They are also both ready. Unfortunately, it's still a risky plan everywhere. So we are declaring war on Turkey. <sighs> Conquer. Yep, yeah, send. The Russian Empire declared war on Turkey. That means we can hit go on this army. And we will also hit go on this army straight away. Uh, we have called in the Italians, the Germans, uh, the Hungarians. Uh, we have called in all the Axis to help us. We will also start right away with our Marines. Because before they send back the troops over there. Uh, our initial pushes are not going that greatly, uh, except for the push which is supported by a lot of tanks. Even though with a lot of tanks it is not that much actually, look at that. Uh, he's a hill fighter and yeah, could work out a bit better. But I have an airfield here and I completely forgot I could get some... Uh, how much are room is on this airfield? Okay, I will never amount of anything. France, Prussia, nuclear technology. Following the initial test, the political France. The French are already researching nuclear technology in 93, 93, th 1939. Holy crap. Uh, national focus has been complete. Okay. So we will get the tactical bombers in here. Ooh, that was the wrong button. Like this, yeah, and like the fighters as well. Uh, I can't, okay, so you are okay. Deploying from reserves and then you will have like strategic bombing. Yep, yeah. uh-huh. And as well as a new wing, the fighters, the interwar fighters, it's not that great a deal, but better than nothing, right? Uh-huh. Oh, well, I can actually... Uh, the, uh, oh, yeah, I did give them an ace. So they will go with air superiority. They can reach what? 18.3%. Uh, <laughs> Range is not very good on my fighters. But still, uh, the strategic bombing will probably help a bit. Uh, where are my marines? My marines actually did land in Istanbul. No, no crack. They are going to be repelled in Istanbul. German Reich has claimed Mammal. Uh, which I think was belong was part of my my ta yep it was a little bit of me but they claimed it that's okay that's okay I can live with that uh, we have not national focus set yet so we have to do that here um, and like I said I can't go that because we are in an offensive war which is really really that bad that would have been nice I should have read up first. Uh, how different stuff works out. Um, yeah, I could go with more more recruitable uh, population. Also gives me some air experience. I could move my at least owned by Russian Empire. Uh, I could get some military factories, move them around. Uh, I'm not going to do that right away, though. I'm going to claim. We did reconcile with uh, Japan. Cities land becomes owner and control of North Sakhali. And claims Skiam. We are going to do that. We are going to claim it. And I think it's that Skiam. No, it's that Skiam. I think this one, we will be getting control of this part here pretty soon. I think. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, wait. It was uh, saying there's something. No, no, no. That's okay. Uh, I think I get a claim somewhere over here. But we will see. Time will tell. So my push is still not going great down here. <laughs> well, I think, uh, yeah, you are going very aggressively and you're not. So you're going aggressively as well. That might help. 
if they start to push over here and over here as well. I know I could use the right click command to actually tell them to go. My bombers are in here now, which is good. My marines are still trying to land. Uh, we did destroy two convoys. Okay, my marines broke. My marines are falling back. Um, yeah. But they're just falling back, so I haven't lost them. That's, that's a good thing. And I will be able to restart another marine invasion pretty soon. And I will probably start it right away over here. Like, closer to the border. Uh, not Istanbul itself, but next to Istanbul, and then get a land push in, like from two fronts, if possible. I might should land over here, there is a harbor. I will see, I will see. I need to wait till the marines are back here, and when all the marines are back here, I can create a new army with them, and give them a new, uh, direction to push. We are still not able to push in here. We are able, though, to push in here, which is nice. The Italians have sent some troops to help. Quite a lot of, actually. Which is nice. Just a bit sad that it's just the Italians. I would, have that, I would have been happy to see some German tanks in here as well. But, yeah, we will see how it goes on. So, the push down here is working out. This one we will win, definitely. Uh, this one we probably will win. It's not definite yet. It's going on for quite some while already. My tanks are not doing that great anymore. Here we are losing, just straight out. Because they are just entrenched too deep. But as soon as we, yeah, we have managed to push here. Which will end up in pushing over here as well. Why, well, you don't have any orders? Yeah, I can't order you around though. Uh, we did do sink another British convoy, a couple more British convoys over there, which is always nice. Uh, now, yeah, now you see, now just the push starts to work. As soon as they are not entrenched anymore, uh, if they have been broken once, it's going to be easier. So their marines are still green, which is a bit sad. Uh, whoops. The United Kingdom has called Luxembourg as our enemy in the Russian-Estonian War. Russian-Estonian War has been merged with the German-Luxembourg War. Uh, okay, the German Reich declared war on Luxembourg. Uh, Scandinavia. Interest in Scandinavia. We will see what we will shall see what it brings. That's good. You're our new army. You are going to get the commando. Uh, you will be doing a naval invasion from here to here. To here? Uh, no, to here. I think that's the province with the harbor, right? Yeah. It's just 15 days. I reserved convoys 15 and 35 days till it is ready to go. Yeah. Uh, enter. Now five divisions are ready to do that. That's okay. Uh, I think I need... I think I definitely need to up my convoy building. I think that's a bit of a problem. <laughs> I think it's shift. No, it's that shift click. I'm, I'm producing quite a lot a day. But yeah. I think I need to do that. So our push is starting to work down here. Finally, this push is yellow. Meaning we could be winning it. Um... Yeah, there are not a lot of air combats or airplanes in this fight because I don't really have any airplanes over here. I think I have... Uh, yeah, I have 100% air superiority down here. My bombers... Oops, that should go like this. My bombers are doing strategic bombing. I guess that's what we see down here. Uh, like... Whoop. Over here, uh, we did destroy some uh, infrastructure already. Come on, manage to do this push, please. <laughs> My marines still need a couple of days to get ready. Actually, quite a lot of days. And, yep, you see, the German Reich has a took mammal. Oh, the German Reich is fighting against Poland, so... I think I just can hit go on my armies over here. Uh, Soviet theater? Nope. This one is... Does it have a front? Yeah, it does. So go. 
I think we are in war with Poland, right? Yep, we are. So we do not need to claim anything here. Uh, this army here as this general. Um, superior enemy fighters, large river crossing. Disadvantage, just go anyway. And what's this border? Ah, that's a Hungary. Yeah, we are pulling, pushing in from all directions, though. Oh yeah, <laughs> that worked out nicely. Uh, okay, uh, is it 1939 now? It is. So, Republic of China has capitulated. Okay. Uh, where was it going to look? I was going to look somewhere. What I wanted to do? Uh, research I wanted to do, yeah. And it is 1939, so we can go with infantry weapons too, which takes a little while. There has been... We sank some Zaps again. Uh -huh, submarine. 13. Where is the army 13? Um... Aren't we allied with those? Not yet. So they don't need to go. However, this front here looks very interesting. Ah, it's like all around. Yeah. We are pushing in on... On Poland quite hard. On all the fronts as well. Turkey front isn't going that great though. I think I would have needed more mountaineers. Uh, Belgium has been added to the war. Crap. It's just not working out very nicely. So, near east, uh, you still need to... Just 10 days of the 34 days already done. Which takes a quite a while still. Will you push, please? <laughs> Ah, oh, man. Uh, here we have sunk another couple of Turkish uh, convoys. We are pushing over here. What did we take here? Uh, Villon. We will have a cutoff here in a se any second now. Yeah, we are pushing all around Poland. So Poland is done. Hungary, Germany and Russia is pull pushing in on Poland. Even though we are losing on this front. For some reason. Uh, for some weird reason, my front is gone down here, uh, so we need to stop. Uh, I think that's you, right? You don't have a front anymore. So, shift. That's the wrong button. Control. No, that's the wrong button as well. One division is fighting down here, uh, so we do it like this. Yeah, like that. Why isn't that working? Well, I don't care. Just move in. Then. If your front is gone, it doesn't work that way out. Just move in. Just right click. That should work out. I want some part of that country. <laughs> oh man. Uh, yeah, just move in here. Thank you. Poland will capitulate any minute now, I think. Oh, look at that. The Italian needs help down there pretty soon. Uh, that's the Iranian front. Luxembourg has capitulated. That at least worked out pretty far fast. How are we doing here? 28 days. You go when you're ready. How is the front going over here? Could work out a little bit better. We did, uh, however, push quite a bit. And I think as soon as we did that, they kind of broke. So we will, as soon as this fight is done over here, we will have a new order to move you to this port harbor over here. Which gives us an additional... Yeah, like that, that should be good. Which gives us an additional... Um, Harbor where we get how we call it uh, equipment. No, uh, 
What's the English word I'm looking for? Oh, look, the Italians did a naval landing down here. So the Turks are preoccupied down here. Um, Greek? Greeks? What are the Greeks doing here? Why are we... Oh, my... <laughs> My naval, mar my marines have been landing here already. So details, the national focus has been done. We did have a claim on this part here. Can't do anything with that. We can still can't do that. Um, let's go with this then. So you marines, you will have front line also on this side, uh, please. So like. Like, uh, three marines will have this as a front line, and the other two have this as a front line. So, nope. So, those two will have an offensive line to here. And the other three will have an offensive line to here. Ooh, crap. Uh, well, I was going to say we'll have an offensive line to here. And go. That looks to be pretty nice. Uh, so we are doing some con. <laughs> we are fighting for some against some French, uh, not convoys. Yeah, convoys. Convoys was the right word. So how is it going down here? How is my army pushing? Uh, Blue army should be pushing here. Yeah, we are getting plus. There's a one tank division plus one infantry division doing the push. Details are. Good, so we are going to go with the repair research down here. Where, who wants to send some expeditionary forces? Hungary wants to send some expeditionary forces. They can do that. There was a naval battle which just started to become a real battle again. We sank a sub. We have some fighters which have no mission because the wing is destroyed. Okay. Uh, also, this fighter ring is going to be in eh, Eastern Poland. You're still bombing Eastern Poland, which is okay. For the moment, at least. Uh, I mean, I do not have air superiority, air superiority at all. So, Soviet theater... Um, you are still have an order. And you don't. You don't at all, so I guess what you guys can do is, yeah, I know, it will delete all that. Yep, come down here. But as soon as you're down here, you will have an offensive line to go and push to this river. Yep, that's good. That's good. <coughs> Move out. Um, how about you move in here? Like that. That looks nice. Because I don't know why it is not working with this army. This army is very strange. I couldn't get them, get them an offensive lineman over here for some reason. And oh, now I can. No, you see, it doesn't take it, and I don't know why, because not everybody's fighting, it's just, at least the offensive line should be taken, but I don't know why I cannot do that. So if I can't do it, I won't do it, and I just leave it like that. So what did we do here? We sank five British subs, very nice. And how is it going? We did take Istanbul, very cool, very, very cool. Uh, so we have our... Flotilla, which will have this sea as well. We're doing some sub, uh, some convoy raiding over here as well. Uh, maybe over here as well. We have three, uh, three sea zones we can choose from, and we will do that. So, uh, oh frick, we did lose the harbor though. And oh, look at that. <laughs> the Italians just sent a shitload of troops in here. Wow. German Reich formalized anti-Soviet pact. Yeah, 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 that's cool. We will stand by Germany and its allies against the Soviets. Anyone could start another world war with such a pact. Uh, 
Uh, Russian Empire gets plus 50 to impact, you know, it's a notory option of Russian Empire minus 50. Uh, anti Soviet pack which grants. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Uh, we did lose two destroyers here against 12 destroyers, which is okay. Well, not okay, but works out. Uh, what the hell are you two guys doing? How about you just come back over here? Because, well, if 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 you are doing stuff like that, um, because this army doesn't have any orders anymore, or any real orders anymore, so uh, yeah, just go over here to Ankara and goddamn push. And those guys are still going strong, well, strong. It could be better. <laughs> Uh, okay, so these ships are repairing in here. Uh, I think I could merge them. Yep, I did merge them. That's good. So we get a couple more destroyers in here. Okay, uh, we have another research slot where we can go for... It is still 39. Uh, 39, did we get another tank tech? We get a medium tank in 39, so we're going to research that. That's okay. Um... We did have, we did sank uh, some destroyers, or at least one destroyer over here. Uh, which would they go going to do? Like, okay, the Poland push is still going on strongly here. Sort of. Do we have like unassigned? Whoops, unassigned troops somewhere. Yeah, here. Yeah. You go in here. Well, actually, you should join this guys. Uh, you should join. What's that? Purple 12? Yeah. Crap. Um, did it again. Where are you? You should join this guys like this. Yep, that's good. This fight will be over soon. Where the Germans, uh, we're still fighting against Poland. We still haven't finished the Polish war for some reason. Uh huh. You are attrition. You should come up here. You should come up here, my friend. Yep, like this. They're holding here. Uh, the Italians are just moving through, actually. They did not help in the attack the way I was suspecting it. Uh huh. So those guys are two Marines are holding here, one Marine is holding here, which is cool. We have the straight, we have Istanbul. That was the important part, and I wasn't even paying attention to it, actually. Rome has fallen, crap. So the French are actually in Rome. Uh, my troops aren't down here yet, or at least not all of them. Not all of them are down here, but I need to push aggressively anyway. As soon as the rest has a, have a... Yeah, well, actually, no. Nah, execute. I already told them to execute. Cool. Well, then execute. That, what? You're in the wrong front. Oh no, that's the wrong army. Uh, you haven't been told to execute. And you will... Just minus 80% disadvantage. Okay, that's not good. So time is running by. It's not looking that great for me. Uh, the, there are some German tanks in Leningrad. For what reason whatsoever. Uh, we have a 70% national unity, which is good. Uh, we have some Tanin. Tallinn. Okay, so I need to get some troops over here. So you, uh, you get split off. Uh, you be in your own army. And you will have orders to, yeah, do policing over there. So we did take the last part of Poland or parts of Poland here. Um, where is this army? This one is just holding here. This army is just holding Swedpol. This army is doing that up there. This army is doing I don't know what. So I guess uh, you guys could move down here as well. Be actually part of this army. Actually, then I need a field marshal down here. Um, max entrenchment, max entrenchment. 
own combat with yeah and you're just a general but you are a ranger so field marshal this field marshal over here <clears throat> should work out nicely uh these guys are still pushing poland which is good well the front is a bit derped up but uh that's this army nope that's this army which is doing that uh huh I think not everybody is assigned to this front anymore. Now they are. And they're pushing hard. So I need to wait till everybody is down here of my uh, purple army. So 27. How far are they along? How about they click over here like this? There's still some troops coming in. Not a lot though. I think that's the last one of those. If they are down here, we will be able to uh, go and go on to the attack. So we did research uh, social realism. We did research the close combat fighters. That's cool. Um, we are researching medium tanks. I could go with artillery too. I think I should do that. Nope. I uh, go first with the anti tank. Thing. Not that I'm producing it, but I should go with it. Uh, we did uh, destroy two other, uh, other destroyers here. We have some convoy here, some convoys here. Uh, actually, the German planes did it. Uh, what else? Over here again, we lost this uh, uh, destroyer. And that was about it. Okay, we don't have any national focus set anymore. We can't do that. We can... That's not mutually exclusive. Huh. Interesting. So I still could get that. Uh, which raises the opinion of the Russians. Uh, um, uh, which goes down over there. It does not own an offensive war. Crap. Ah, oh, man. That's also a non-offensive war thing I have to do there. I can't go that because it's cannot have, it's it's mutually exclusive. But I can go with this, though. So, okay. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. If you did like this video, please hit the like button. You can also subscribe to my channel or follow me on Facebook or Twitter. The links will be in the video description. And I think I'm going to lose those guys. And like always, guys, one more time, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.